It's Monday. It is December the 12th. Tonight and tomorrow will be first alert weather days in Colorado as a very potent storm system moves in our direction. It was over near Vegas early today. It's going to take a track into southeast Colorado and then head up here into Nebraska and South Dakota. That's a favorable storm track for us to get quite a bit of snow in Denver, but this is a complicated storm and it looks like for the most part we're going to be spared the worst of it here in the metro area. On the eastern plains it's a different story. Blizzard warning from midnight tonight until midnight tomorrow night. It's the first blizzard warning of the season for Colorado. This is I-70 from Deer Trail uh, out toward Lyman and then I-76 east of uh, the Wiggins area through Fort Morgan up to Sterling. It's going to be 4 to 10 inches of snow. All right, but you put that snow together with wind gusts to at least 45 miles per hour. That's going to create white out conditions for some areas there out east. Meanwhile, winter weather advisory in the mountains from 11 a.m. today until 5 p.m. on Wednesday. It's a long duration snow event. Over the course of all that time, we'll get about 5 to 10 inches for most areas, less around Grand Junction an inch or two, 2 to 5 down around Cortez and Durango. North of there, uh, the Million Dollar Highway, 550, and over toward Wolf Creek Pass, we're looking at a lot more snow, at least 6 to 12 inches, perhaps up to 14 inches in a few spots. And I would not be surprised if we have a few areas uh, west of Estes Park up near the uh, National Park they get maybe 18 inches of snow. For most of us in Metro Denver, Boulder and Fort Collins, we're looking at anywhere from 1 to 4 inches of snow. So this is not going to be a big snow event for the Front Range Urban Corridor specifically. But there's going to be this very sharp gradient on the east side of town where snow totals go up big time. We're going to watch the airport because that DIA area is going to be right on the edge of the heavier snowfall. Uh, you get just east of the metro area. That's where we're expecting four to eight inches of snow. Let's talk about the timing real quick. We'll get through today during the daytime with no snow. Uh, starting at the tail end of the commute, we may get a little snow, especially on the south and west sides of town. And then later in the night, midnight onward, pretty good chance for snow that could continue into the morning hours tomorrow. A few more snow bands could come through the metro area during the day tomorrow, mainly before lunchtime. And then we'll see the snow end in the metro area by the end of the day tomorrow, but it continues in the mountains through Wednesday. Temperatures today on the mild side again, highs in the 50s, 10 degrees cooler than yesterday, and then tomorrow we drop uh, quite a bit. We'll struggle to get above freezing tomorrow on our first alert weather day. And then no big typical Colorado warm up. We stay in the 30s Wednesday through the weekend and into early next week. Again, we're going to go a long time with chilly weather. Stay warm and don't forget your latest weather over on the stream. CBS News Colorado every 10 minutes.